Ice Kennels Camp. Honestly, man, shit, doing your thing, man, because shit, I remember when I had my one dog, she was pregnant. That's when I first met you, uh, Hilton. You know what I'm saying? He was there, you showed love. He wasn't no, no type of person to discriminate. He was a hundred, straightforward person, you know what I'm saying? You, you, you give love to the community, you know what I'm saying? You give, you give a lot, you know what I'm saying? Not a lot of people do that. And then, you know, what you're doing too, you're bringing everybody together. And that, that right there is everything, to bring everybody together so everybody can know each other. And like I said, do business with each other, build a relationship. But I mean, definitely what you're doing is definitely different. You know what I'm saying? You're bringing something new to the town and, you know, so a lot of people's mindset ain't there. So definitely doing good for that. You know what I'm saying? If you go on my Instagram right now, it's Savage Bullies, uh, but it will be changing to Get Back Bullies real soon. Uh, probably within the next couple weeks, I'll be uh, switching everything over to that, getting my logo made and everything. And um, right now, like I said, it's, it's, I'm picking up little by little, so it's, it's gonna take a while, but I'm gonna get there. Um, but yeah, man, I'm just I'm, I'm getting back in the game slowly but surely. We gonna definitely. I was one Savage Bullies. I'm uh, switching it up. Get back Bullies. I'm getting back in the game. It's been a while, but uh, I'm getting there. Little by little. You know what I'm saying? I, I ain't gonna lie. I want to give a shout out to uh, Dream Team Bullies, though, because uh, he got me back going where I need to be. He's putting me where I need to be right now, because uh, before I let go of all my dogs, and now I'm uh, getting back in the game slowly but surely. I'll be there. What made me get back, honestly, man, I, I, in the beginning, I had a dedication for these dogs. When I was first getting into it, I, my mind was set for the dogs, but, you know, I had a couple hiccups. Um, so I ended up, at one point in time, I ended up putting like eight bands into these dogs. Literally all I had, uh, all my savings to these dogs, and nothing was going the way I wanted to go. So, you know, I was putting money here, money there. And uh, every t every every litter I tried or anything I did it just didn't go go through. So I felt like maybe it wasn't this game wasn't for me. But then you know I spoke to some people and uh, shout out to CNC because you know he was talking the other day. You know he put me on, you know he, he put me on to some shit and he made me feel like you know I could do. It, you know what I'm saying he told me you know don't let nobody talk you down. You know what I'm saying you can do that shit, do your shit, do it right, don't give up. And uh, little by little I'm getting back in here though. Oh, sooner or later, I'm gonna have some heat coming sooner. Rochester, everywhere. We we worldwide with this. Honestly, there's a lot of people I know here. Like I said, CNC Exotics, Fire, Shit Gun Road Bullies, one of my closest friends. Um, Dream Team. See those uh, five, you know what I'm saying? They've been doing this shit for a while. My man's uh, Loyalty Matters, been one of my boys for a very long time. I've seen him come from nothing, so that's, I know he worked real hard for where he at right now, you know what I'm saying? So has Gun Road Bully, all he's been doing is pushing himself, getting it through. Um, and then, uh, yeah, other, too much other, I don't really know, but shit, God bless them all, you know, healthy dogs. Hope everything go well, you know what I'm saying? Being a list, you know, it lets other people know who's who, you know what I'm saying? Gives other people opportunity to explore different dogs. Gives, uh, give these people, you know, a chance to be able to stud their dog out so people know what they get in, you know what I'm saying? Dirty people I know here, they shit, they got nasty lineups, you know what I'm saying? All dogs is paperworked up. They got everything to show for their dogs, and like I said, this is, I mean, it's just official. It, it shit definitely came a long way because I remember at one point in time, shit, nobody even knew what the fuck bullies was. And now for it to come this far, everybody getting together, you know what I'm saying, as a community, getting these dogs going, it's just, it's just fire. It brings people together, you know what I'm saying? Ooh, that's a good one. Shit, the advice I give you guys, man, never give up. That's a mistake I made. I invested a lot of money and I lost a lot. But you gotta crawl before you walk. 
I mean, that's just something I've been. I've been an impatient person, and in the beginning, it's just I wanted everything there, you know. And I and I and I come to realize that shit shit don't work like that. You got to take your time. If shit don't happen overnight, you know what I'm saying? Shit don't happen overnight. So you got to take your time with this and, and give it time. And, you know, eventually it'll work. Work its magic. But you know, I, the, what I tell y'all is just take your time, cause this shit. I mean, shit ain't easy. You know what I'm saying? You gotta have time for these dogs. You gotta be able to maintain them. You gotta. You do what you gotta do for them and you know, make sure they health wise is good and all I say is just take your time, don't rush it, and uh y'all get through it. You know what I'm saying? Just don't don't give up. You know what I'm saying?